life. This is Renee with Renee's Paper Treasures. And today I want to share with you how I made this cute card from a, from a swap I received from on stage. This is a picture of the swap. I received a swap from Jennifer Ivanko. And I cased this card from that swap. So let's begin. This card was made using the pansy punch and the scallop top punch. The stamp set that I used was the flower shop stamp set. So let's assemble the card. The first thing I need to do is I've already cut and scored my my card base. I've already stamped and punched my pansies, cut and punched my tag, cut and punched my banner. On the ends of my banner, I did a little sponging of the Emerald Envy ink which is the featured colored ink for this particular for this project so let's start with the assembly I'm using festive birthday designer series paper One of the great things, you know, these two punches were one of the first two punches that I ever owned. I received them when I first joined Stampin' Up! to become a demonstrator. When you join Stampin' Up! to become a demonstrator, you get to create your own starter kit. They'll give you like a suggested list, but you get to go through the website or the catalog and design your custom design your own starter kit with all the supplies that you want in it. So I'm using Emerald em Emerald Envy ribbon to go in the top of my tag. So I'm gonna I just thread this through the hole of the tag, pull it through, do a little assembly to make it look straight, adjustments here and there, okay, then I'm going to use some enamel shapes. Sorry about that. Some dimensionals on the back of my tag. Okay, and you just put this, put this right about there. Okay, that's that piece. Now, for my sentiment banner. I'm using this Celebrate stamp. I hope you can see it. And this Celebrate stamp was one of the stamps they came in one of my paper pumpkin kits but what like with every paper pumpkin kit even after you use up all of your supplies you're still left with some amazing stamps okay 
Okay. So let's just stamp this. Hope I get my fingers out of the way on my head. All right. There's that. Now I'm going to use some more dimensionals to adhere this, to adhere the banner. need to put some dimensionals on my pansies okay let's let's place the pansies one goes here one goes about there and let's place the sentiment banner It goes right about here. The last item is to bring in a little bling. And for that, I'm using the white perfect accents, which are basically like some pearl enamel shapes. Okay, so what do you think? My card is complete. I really like how they turned out. I because for some reason I just really I have really fell in love with that festive birthday designer series paper. Because there it has some really great colors in it. Emerald Envy, Tempting Turquoise, Melon Mambo, and of course pumpkin pie. But you will find all of the measurements. And the products used to create this this project listed below my video in a link to my blog. Thank you for watching my video and see you next time. Bye for now.